Howdy everyone and welcome back to my channel. I am your host Sank the Sickness and today we are sadly on the last episode possibly because I don't know what else uh, Well, you know, what? yeah, it would probably be the last episode because I probably just do everything in one go But yeah, we're on the last episode of Dread Collection 5 um, <laughs> Before I even talk like pop off about this game. I should probably just Go ahead and just finish the game, and then I'll give my thoughts about it. This was already open. Uh, what other door? Over there, yeah, that's true. The launch pad. Oh! Cool. It's both. It's both. Ah. Uh, huh. Oh well. I'm sure we'll get more answers once we actually beat uh, the game. Uh, but let's go ahead and look at this. Honestly, this would be a really cool type of pizzeria. Why? It's like one of those photos where, okay, because something's off. Something's bothering about this photo. I don't know what. It looks like if they were to like, that like vertical line in the middle and then you put your face and it kind of makes everything symmetrical. That's what it looks like. Oh, cool. Some feats, look at that. So look at that content right there. I know some of you, some of you freaks out there. No, I'm just kidding. I can't believe they just gave you guys for free content. Why why have an OnlyFans where y'all can just look at these toes? Anyways. Onwards. Why does it sound like that? The the floor, I mean. I doubt carpet sounds like that. Wee! Woo! Look at this. This is fun. I would like. Oh, they do move! Oh, that's fun. Reminds me when I was a kid. Yo, this is weird. Can these move? No. Only these. Why did the music just... No, no. It was the music. It was like the atmosphere. I was like, why did it stop? You... I can't get out of there. Yo, Ma Pops, how y'all doing? <laughs> Don't mind if I do. Uh, oh. Die. Why are I? Get away from me. I don't like that this is super close. Why were they able to just cheat like that? Oh, that sucks. Is that what I think it is? Ma? Pa? Ma? Guys? <laughs> you can see the little toes. There you go, another toe pick. Anyways. I hate that. That was a loud noise. I was I saw it coming, right? I saw it coming. Ah, <sighs> but it still freaked me out. <laughs> Look at that. All twelve. Yeah, twelve presents. And now for the final candle. Osvonti Gallery. I'll go over them again uh, towards the end, I think. But let's go to let's play the final game in Tirum by Phantom Sloth Games. Alfred moved to Hollywood with nothing more than a few dollars in his pocket and a dream in his heart. A dream to be front and center as the leading man in a major motion picture. All eyes would be on him and in Tirum. Ah, <sighs> here we go. Go to settings. Let's just, just to be safe and sound, right? I'll lower this just a little bit. 
you know? Better safe than sorry. Music doesn't have to be that loud, I feel. Okay. Let's check it out. Extras. We haven't even played the actual game. Oh. It seems Harry just couldn't separate himself that from his precious television set. So loud. This could stand as a warning to those who have seen tonight's episode. That was with so Harry, loud. he found himself obsessed with the media displayed within his bounded box of images. But will Alfred accept their fate of a life without fame and sacrifice all they have worked for in the Hollywood scene to avoid becoming part of the interim? My guy, why was that so loud? I was so close to just taking Alfred, off. Alfred, get to work. We don't pay you to watch reruns. The studio better be clean by morning, otherwise you'll be the next thing I cut from the studio's budget. Oh, so loud. I thought, you know what? Not bad. You know, we should. That should be enough. But no. I kid you not. Too loud. Too loud. You know what? I'm just gonna lower it super down. Super down. Cause there's. Did that? That didn't change. My God. Don't tell me this thing does not. No wonder that was horrible. That was so bad. Please don't tell me y'all are. Oh, dude, that was so loud. Please, no. That was so bad. What is. Now I'm scared. Oh, guess we have to pick pick this up. That's trash. That was so loud. I don't know if it's that loud on the recording, but dude, that was so bad. I, I'm gonna have to lower that so much, guys. That was horrible. <laughs> I was literally about to throw my headset to the ground from how bad that, how loud that was. Anyways, oh. Ah, yes, sir. Uh, don't worry about it, sir. I got you. What? Why are you just taking a picture of his eye? That's so weird. Anyways. Downstairs I go. The green ball. Oh. Oh, it's right here, isn't it? Oh. Why, why, why did that sound like that? Why did that sound like that? I got a chair. I'm not afraid to use it. <laughs> Whoa. What's going on? Oh, look at that. <laughs> That's funny. There's something in the back. Authorized person only. I see. Did that work? That was another eye. How you doing? Look at you. <laughs> put, put two of y'all. Oh, ew. <laughs> Look at that, it's funny. It bounces. That's that's funny. Oh what's with that shotgun sound? Okay. I guess just keep cleaning, I suppose, like I've been told, or they'll lower my pay or something. I don't know. I was more concentrating on the loud noise. Um interim. What does that even mean? Did I not pick this up? Ah, oh, there we go. Nice, nice, nice. Now what am I supposed to do with that eye? Boss? Boss man? So dramatic, the music. Jokes on them. I took off my headphones the moment I started hearing the noises. Alright, I can hear it through my headset. That's crazy.
What? What is this? Am I good? So far. Oh, okay. I'm just grab you. What's going on? Right, is this eyeball talking to me? Oh, can I? Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Cause it's a bigger spate. It's a bigger spate. No, 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 no. Oh, oh that ball is gone. <laughs> He's gone. Where am I? I don't know where you are. Why does it keep taking pictures? I think I don't think it's pictures. Yo, is there a band here? Coming from there. Hey, those are the other games. That's cool. I. Th Where am I supposed to go? Probably here, right? I'm sorry. Did you want? Did you want the? Did you want the eyeball that the car ran over? Cause uh, yeah, nah. I think it's not coming back. I think it's cool they put the other games on as a poster billboard thing. Whoa. Did you guys see that? I could have swore something like popped up. Oh, it was probably just a raindrop. Possibly, possibly. Um. Oh, I can zoom in. It's another eyeball. If I can just make it there before I get run over, I think I'll be fine. Yo, let's play some hoops. Oh, at basketball court. Oh, this poor eye. Oh. Bro, hey, yo, get over here. Am I going to get run? No. I'm scared. Oh, there you go. Get over here. Dude. Wait. How can they even go through there? Oh, that's how they can. Can I just toss this in there? Yep. Alright, cool. So. What about my presents? Literally the worst game, dude. Oh, that was so bad. Why was I not able to just lower the volume so bad? I don't even know what this game was. The worst one. The sad that that was the last one. Um, I wonder if it's gonna show all of them. Um. Can I not open the presents? You're gonna tell me I can't open all the presents. All right, cool. Where's the last page at least, right? Is it here? No, I'm guessing it's outside. Splash. A lot of people think that being brave means never to being never being afraid. That's not really true. Being brave means you're scared shitless. I have strength to show what you really are anyways. My name is Aaron, and today is my birthday. Wait, that doesn't explain a lot though. Why did the parents get like that? Also, why does he look so much older now? He was also changing if you look at it. Well. I don't know what I was expecting for an ending. But there you guys have it. Um, that was Dread X Collection. All well, not all, but oh, I was missing one of them. But I wasn't able to. Oh, that wasn't able to get recorded. 
cool enough. Anyways, um, that was fun. That was really fun. There were some, there were some hidden gems in there. So there were some that were like, all right, and then there was like real bad ones. Correo. That was a good game. That was pretty good. Husbanti. Uh, Husbanti is really good for like a starter game. Gallery. I don't even think I finished Gallery. The Book of Blood <laughs> pissed me off, but it was a good constant. Vestige. It's, for, it's going too fast, man. I can't remember. A game by Phantom Sloth Games. Dude, that was so loud. What was that? I don't know. That's crazy. They didn't let me actually change. Oh. Is that it for Star Wars? For sure, that's it. Right, that's just it. Well, yeah. Like, Hasvanti, I think, was really good as a starter game, you know? Because it's like... It was a good start for the horror, you know? Of what to, like, somewhat expect, more or less. Gallery, I don't think I actually finished it. Because it did, like, crash that one time. I don't know if that was because, like, the game wanted me to stop there or not. But I don't even think I got the achievement for that game. Um, but yeah, it was good. I liked the the audio thing. That really gave me chills. And I did not feel good <laughs> hearing all of that. Um, well, actually, no, scratch that. It was a good kind of like audio. Not like in Terra. That was super bad. That actually hurt my ears a bit. That was super loud. Book of Blood. I like the concept. It's just, I'm an idiot, you know, or they could have just done a visual tutorial. Uh, but yeah, I'm you know, mostly an idiot. Correo, I think that's, uh, that's where it started to, like, get, like, really good, you know? That's where it was, like, popping off. Ron Stigma, really good as well. I'm sad that you guys couldn't see it and, like, I could just play it, but it's, it's not going to be the same. That would be the same. Um, Spirit Guardian, I liked it. It was a nice... Uh, I liked the art style. It was really good. I like that it's a 2D character in a 3D environment. I really like those type of games. We Never Left, that was also pretty good. Uh, you're basically doing what you want the person to do. And I guess that's some type of horror, yeah. Like, just... Knowing he's behind you and everything, and like he's in the house somewhere, you know he is, because you can hear the noises in the in the house. Um, I I wonder if there's like a good ending to this, because I feel like you could, this could be a good ending somewhere, but I guess guess not. Vestige, that was so sad. That was so sad with the. He's like, I'm here. Don't worry. That was so sad, man. That was a good one too. Resver, it was I. It wasn't like it was definitely some of the, like the bottom tier, I think. The art style was nice, but like the story was like eh. Ludo Malika, that one's pretty good. They gave me like once or twice. I don't remember. Um, but it was I didn't like that. Like okay, like the first round. Like, that you go all around. I feel like that would have been a good stop. Because a second time, it's kind of like, eh. But it was all, like, uh, scripted. So, I'm pretty sure all those rules were scripted. Beyond the Curtains. Mm, it's okay. Not one of my favorite ones, either. Like, if you have a, a fear of, like, uh, puppets and mannequins and all that, because, like, yeah, I could see how it could be scary. Um, it scared me like once just because like it was loud and unexpected and the like, moving of wooden puppets or whatever Trash, <laughs> I'm sorry. It's just The audio really did just ruin the whole experience for me But I feel like the audio is what it only had going for it. I wasn't too sure what exactly they were trying to do uh, But yeah can I play this band one more time? It's sad. I really... Out of all, this whole area, 
this was my favorite because the music sounded really good. I think it was super good. Um, man, that's it. That's crazy that we actually finished. I thought it was. It felt like forever ago. But that's the end of this. And let's talk about the. I'm not really sure what. I don't know if there's like a. Oh. Dang. It shows you real early on, doesn't it? Because you look at the book. That's them. That's the dad and that's the mom. I don't know what made them change, though. Whatever that is. Something about, like, space or whatever. But, like, that doesn't explain why the parents got like that. If you can, you can actually see that they were already changing on this panel. Huh. Yeah. That's alright, I guess. Probably just the problems of real life and stuff. Sometimes you have to face your own fears and grow as a person. But sometimes facing those fears makes you numb to the pain. Perhaps. Yeah, I don't know why they got like that. Honestly. But... Yes. The, uh, that's... Four bucks for a comic. Oh, you're just gonna stop there? <laughs> Alright. But, yeah guys. Um... That's it for Dread Collection 5, you know, I appreciate all those who've uh, watched all the episodes that I've stuck through to the very end of this collection. Um, I still have a bunch of other horror games that I've been dying to try, but I've been just going through this first. Um, I'm probably gonna do some TikTok videos about each of these videos. And then I'll probably continue back with the recording. Um, shouldn't take long, I think. I don't even know how many I'm going to make. But, yeah, I got a bunch of other games that are just, I'm ready to just sit down and play them. And, uh, yeah, it's just be a different experience than all of these other games. Uh, but I'm so glad they, uh, they did this collection, you know. I never would have thought about that they have like well they have like five other because it's the fifth one so they have like four other ones i'm not sure if i'm gonna play them but this is fun it's really fun but i think that's gonna be it for today guys thank you so much for watching all of dread x collection 5 with me and i'll see you on the next one Bye bye